Mr. Pal, um, Rakesh Sharma, of course, was the first Indian to be in space. Uh, but as we all know, it is group captain Shubhanshu Shukla who is the first Indian to set foot on the ISS. And when we talk about the ISS and this grand space collaboration that you have between the European Space Agency, uh, SpaceX, even NASA, uh, the JAXA, and now ISRO also making that contribution, what does it mean for ISRO's own uh, uh, ambitions as well? See, first of all, we are going on this commercial flight. We have paid 550 uh, crores of rupees hmm. for this one. Right. Uh, see, now the ex I, I, what uh, Ms. Sesti talked about it, that's the aspect about, uh, you know, which the country is looking for. But let me tell you what are the technological uh, achievements. Right. You know, uh, the, we will go through all the documents, see, all the procedures. They, they will get trained through this one. There is a team uh, at, uh, uh, you know, Florida, as well as team will be in Houston, also in Los Angeles. So when they splash down, what sort of thing will happen? When they have gone up, uh, uh, what sort of uh, mission operations are being done? All those, they are becoming part of it. So they will gain a first-hand experience. It's not only the, through the documents they go through it, they will have first-hand experience of this one. Similarly, the doctors who will be there in Houston, and also, at the, they will know how to check it. So, there is a big team which is uh, working behind them. And the team's experience will be much more valuable. Uh, of course, uh, uh, Group Captain Shukla's experience and Group Captain Nair's experience will also be there. They will tell to the other astronauts which are getting trained in India. So, total thing, it will be a first-hand experience. Now, let me tell you one thing. This IESS and going through the thing is different than what we are doing Gagan. Gaganian, the yes. capsule itself will be launched. So there is a slight difference between the uh, two things. But uh, mission operations, going through orbit, and in case of an emergency, how to come out of it, all those things. The, 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 here also some training will be there, rehearsals will be there. All those things will be very useful to us. And of course, we'll have a collaboration when our system goes... Mr. Pal, interestingly, there are 60 experiments uh, which are going to be conducted, out of which seven experiments have been designed by ISRO. What is your understanding of these experiments that have been designed by ISRO and how will they help India uh, in mission 2027? Okay, uh, slight correction. ISRO is the front end, but uh, the uh, seven experiments are by uh, various Indian agencies. And Department of Biotechnology has taken a lead in that one. The, some of the experiments are there about biotechnology. Okay. Like, you know, something about uh, diabetes molecule, something is going on about, you know, there are degrades that is small, uh, uh, some sort of what they call it, piglet, which uh, survived and it was supposed to have been there in a uh, uh, dinosaur's time. How its effect will be there? What will be the effect, microgravity effects on the uh, muscle? muscles, the bone mass, etc. And how it will be regenerate and how degenerate, all those things are there. Not only this, there will be a, uh, a sprouts, you know, they, they will have a germination of the seeds, microgravity. So, uh, and the microalgae, how it grows. Suppose in the future, uh, uh, for food, microalgae, which is uh, eatable, you know, which can be consumed. So, such microalgae, how it can be done. So, for long future things, all these things will be useful. And uh, of course, the uh, group captain uh, will be talking to, uh, I think, HEMS, some six HEM teams, and he'll be having a direct interaction with the schools and other things also. So another, you know, fallout of this one, fallout means a positive fallout is that youngsters will get encouraged. See, uh, we are celebrating 50 years of Aryabhat. I am from the Aryabhat team. Right. We did not know anything about space at that time. You know, we were fresh from college. Okay. Today, the school children know about it. And they are equally involved in it. It's interesting that you say that because remember, group captains also, uh, you know, had that interaction with students as well.